We're here on location at Bellevue Community League in Edmonton, Alberta. Jagmeet Singh is here to uh, do a town hall with the public. There's a couple hundred people here, including many NDP representatives from numerous levels of government. We're going to check it out and try to get a question in. I'm here today with... My name is Brian Breezy Gregg. And what brings you here today, Brian? Well, of course, mainly I came here to hear our leader, uh, Jagmeet Singh, and see what he has to say and to see everyone. I'm also uh, here uh, uh, as a candidate for mayor for the city of Edmonton. I think I'm probably the only candidate uh, that's running for mayor that's here today. And what's this instrument you have with you today? This is a guitar, believe it or not. This is a backpacking guitar. I, I find it convenient to take with me to forums and meetings because uh, it's more natural for me to play the guitar than to speak. Fair enough. And if you had one question for Jagmeet today, what would that be? Wow, you've stumped me there. Well, yes, I know what it would be. I would like to know if he could come to uh, our federal Edmonton Centre um, uh, NDP Association uh, monthly meeting tonight in my backyard. Cool. Well, thank you for speaking to us. Thank you. You're very welcome. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. Today is the day this election where we take Edmonton Grease <laughs> We have big hearts, we give big hugs, but this pandemic has shown us that people are getting left behind. I'm here today with uh, Cody Bonnerchuk, candidate for City Council Ward Tusto Iniwak. And what brings you here today? Uh, I'm just here to check out. I heard that uh, Jugmeet was coming to Edmonton. I think it's important to pretty much go and see anybody that wants to run our country. I'm happy to show up and see what they have to say. And if you had one question for him today, what would that be? I would certainly want to know what the federal NDP's plan would be for supporting cities when it comes to housing funding. Of course, municipalities are the best equipped to be able to provide housing for solutions on the ground, but it takes a lot of funding, so federal, provincial governments need to step up with that funding, so I'm hoping to hear something like that today. Cool. Thanks for talking to us. Yeah, thank you. You know, when folks talk about the NDP and they talk about a movement, they don't often think about Edmonton, but I can tell you all, this is the largest gathering that we've had in this whole campaign. Yeah. Mr. Singh, could I ask, how quickly do you think you'll be able to implement the cuts to student debt? Thank you so much. Say again? How quickly do you think you'll be able to uh, implement the cuts to student debt? Oh, yeah, we can work on that right away. Just Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you. It's a really delicate dance for Singh, so when he was asked about not the support, he chose to focus on the issues that they can agree on, rather than the ones that they don't. Donna? I'm here today with... Uh, Brandy Wiper. Lindsay Bradner. And what brings the two of you here today? Um, just to bring a new voice into um, our country. Um, we're tired of being let down by every politician when the minority gives their vote. It's never treated like, it's never put into effect. So we're hoping that if we have him, he will bring a lot of closure, especially to our Indigenous communities on our MMIW and all the children being found in unmarked graves that Justin Trudeau's father funded. Interesting. If you had one question for Jagmeet Singh today, what would it be? Um, <laughs> I have. Uh, I want to know what he's going to do for our MMIW if he's actually going to do some investigating into the man camps and the RCMP and all the police that are linked to all of our women going missing. We need this to end, so that's why we want him in. Thank you for speaking to us. Thanks so much. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye.